Welcome to Fox Tech. Today we're going to discuss how to receive texts on your iPad without needing an iPhone. If you're looking to streamline your communication directly through your iPad, there are a few essential points to understand. Let's dive in. Firstly, it's important to know that there are two types of messages on Apple devices. The first type is the green bubble messages, which are SMS texts sent through your carrier. These messages require a carrier plan and typically need an iPhone to be forwarded to your iPad or Mac. However, the main focus here is on how to get texts without an iPhone. So let's move on to the second type, the blue bubble messages, also known as iMessages. iMessage is Apple's proprietary messaging service that uses the internet, so there's no need for a carrier plan. This service can work on any Apple device connected to the internet, including your iPad, even if you don't have an iPhone. To set up iMessage, go to your iPad's settings, find the messages section, and follow the steps to activate iMessage. Once set up, you'll be able to send and receive messages from other Apple devices seamlessly. It's important to note that you won't be able to receive traditional SMS texts without an iPhone. Even if your iPad has a SIM card, it can only use the SIM for internet access and not for making calls or sending SMS text messages. Apple has announced a new messaging protocol called RCS, which stands for Rich Communication Services. This advanced messaging protocol enhances SMS with features like read receipts, typing indicators, and high quality media sharing. It works over internet data, allowing for group chats and larger file transfers compared to traditional SMS. While RCS is supported on many Android devices and some carriers, Apple plans to introduce it in iOS 18 and iPadOS 18. This means that in the future, iPads might support RCS, providing a more unified messaging experience across different platforms. However, since it hasn't rolled out yet, we can't provide specific details on its functionality at this time. Thank you for watching this video on Fox Tech. I hope this guide has clarified how to receive texts on your iPad without an iPhone. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. See you guys later.